as if you're looking at me. All things Southern Live. You're looking at me. Louisiana, do you want a great deal? Talk to Jim Taylor. He can make it real in a Chevy. If you're looking for a large selection and a great deal on a used car, truck, or SUV, come to Jim Taylor Chevrolet. We have over 150 in stock. GM certified mid-size and full-size SUVs, two and four-wheel drive trucks, compact mid-size and full-size cars, and 15 passenger vans. Price, service, and selection is what makes you number one at Jim Taylor Chevrolet in Rival. Welcome to All Things Southern, bringing you the charm and heritage of the South. Here's your host, Shelly Tomlinson. Hello, folks. I'm Shelly. They call me the belle of all things Southern. Have a seat and let's chat. I've been watching a most interesting debate play out in a national advice column about funeral etiquette, specifically taking pictures of the deceased. It all began when an irate sister wrote in who had witnessed someone taking a picture of her brother in his casket. Sissy was horrified. Many readers agreed, saying that it was both improper and unseemly. Still others, however, felt just as strongly that there was nothing whatsoever wrong with one last photo op. Say cheese. Oh, right. Never mind. Sissy also said that while she had never seen this practice before moving to the South, she had seen it several times since she got here, implying that this behavior was yet another little oddity of ours. The advice columnists politely disagreed stating that taking pictures of the dearly departed is not a practice confined to the South. True that. And yet, the bell of all things Southern here is willing to confess that where my family is concerned, it may be ground zero. I told y'all about Mama having tombstone twitch, meaning she has become almost more interested in those who have passed than those who remain. And I told y'all that she already has hers and Papa's cemetery plots bought and paid for, along with their tombstones, each inscribed with their own carefully chosen thoughts and scriptures. What I neglected to tell you is that she actually had me take a picture of her posing with said tombstone. She even asked if I wanted to be in the photo with her. I declined. The subject came up over Mother's Day. My family is still divided on it, too. Mama insists that it is quite normal, but many of us remain confused about the point she's making and what we're supposed to do with this picture when, well, you know. I mean, it's not exactly like you can send it to someone and say, wish you were here. I'm not sure it's going to look right in the family scrapbook, and it would just be flat out odd on that little table beside the casket. On the other hand, now that I think about it, it occurs to me that this may be Mama's way of leaving photographic evidence for us girls, assuring us that when that time comes, she will be perfectly fine. And we will be. Y'all have a great big day, and come see me. That's allthingsouthern.com, and this is Shelly with Hugs for All.